I'm in here in the cab. I'm ready to start doing my seam sealer and uh, rust converter and stuff. Well, guys, we got the seam sealer all in and we uh, got the floor painted in the truck here. We let that dry. We'll put our uh, soundproofing in once we're done with the whole truck project. But we're going to let this dry. I'm going to start getting stuff by. Uh, Stuff seen in the outside of the cab for uh, primer. Oh, we're back out here working on the box. We got all the patch panels put in. They're tacked in place. They is out here welding all the seams up now, so it's solid all the way across. And then I'll be grinding the welds down and get ready for the uh, uh, bed liner coating. I'm not going to get carried away trying to fill these everything up, so we're going to really coat this. But he's going to get this taken care of. We got the uh, floor of the truck painted this weekend, as you saw in the uh, earlier clips. I'm going to go to uh, taking these diamond plate rails off the box and then getting ready to paint the underside of the bed so we can put the bed on the truck. But Zaya's got all the patch panels in now, so uh, we're ready to just get the bottom of this box rust encapsulated, primed and painted so we can set it on the truck and get ready for uh, primer and paint. Okay, so I just took my air gun and blasted out this side and my uh, wire wheel and blasted out this side of the uh, bed and cleaned up most of that stuff before I start uh, I'm gonna try and pressure wash it and then we'll start rust encapsulating that. Just to give you an idea how dirty the other side was, this is the other side. This one was just as bad, if not the same. So I'll have to do the same thing, wire wheel it. All that brown is dirt, just stuff that's built up down in there. So that's all getting cleaned out before we put the rust encapsulator on. But Zay has got all them patch panels. Just got, want to show you guys quick this uh I got three-fourths of this box all rust encapsulated and ready for primer um you see the right side here I actually cleaned that all off blew it over there then uh, wire wheeled it then rust encapsulated the other side I haven't done yet we've been doing braces and stuff on things so I wanted to rust encapsulate it dry then I was going to clean this other side off but I thought it's pretty cool uh before and after look at this, if you look from the left to right there. Um, but yeah, you can see all the new cross members are in, all the panels are welded in. Really, once I get that other side rust encapsulated, I'm going to lay the bed down on the ground here. So we can get it primed. And then uh, I got one little patch panel that goes butts up against the cab on the box. We're going to take and fix. As you can see here, we got the box all rust encapsulated on the bottom here. Um, let this dry. We're going to take and finish doing a few weld seams on the other side, and then I'll touch up a little bit more rust encapsulator after we're done welding in case we have any hot spots. Okay, guys, in the last video, we saw we got the doors on. This door's here. Uh, we had two different styles of mirrors, one on each door and we basically just filled the mirror holes. I'm going to actually get some different mirrors. Here's the other door. Our gaps worked out pretty good. I did a little adjustment on the on the door strikes, worked out pretty good. Once again, we filled the mirror bolt holes. I'm going to sand that down, do a little filler on that and get that ready for uh, primer. We also sanded down the visor here. That's uh, ready for primer now. We ran into a hole here. We ran into a hole here. I don't know what they had there, but uh, we'll weld that and fill that shut. Okay, little update. We got the rust capsulator on the bed now. That's all ready to go. 
You get a few more little welding seams to uh, weld up on the front side of the bed. And then I'll just touch up a little bit of the uh, rust encapsulator in case we have any hot spots. And we're going to lay the bed down so that the uh, bottom is facing up. We're going to get that primed and painted.